Next problem, the lamina resting on HP with one of its corner. See this problem, the lamina resting on HP with one of its head. See this is edge and this one is corner. See now how to take first position if the lamina resting on HP with one of its corner. Means corner should be towards your right hand side, edge should be towards your left hand side. Okay. And second sentence, see the second sentence. See the second sentence, okay. The surface of lamina makes an angle of 60 degree with HP. And this problem is also surface of lamina makes an angle of 60 degree with HP. And see the third sentence. If the side opposite to the corner, if the side opposite to the corner on which the lamina rest an angle of 30 degree with VP. Means side opposite to the corner on which lamina rest makes an angle of 30 degree with VP. But this problem, the edge on which it rests is inclined to VP at 60 degree. Means the whatever the resting side or resting edge will be uh, on VP on HP is inclined to VP. But this problem is reverse. Okay. Here in this problem, the la you know resting corner. Okay, that resting corner opposite to that side means this is a corner opposite to this side means this edge is inclined to VP. Okay. So we'll solve the problem here. Please understand the problem very very carefully. So here. Key point is lamina resting on HP with one of its corner and second one is surface of lamina is inclined to HP and third one is side opposite to the corner on which lamina rest is inclined to VP. So very very careful in this type of problem. See here you need to take the heads towards your left hand side. So take heads towards your left hand side. See if you are looking from top of an object the triangular lamina is visible. So use visible line to draw. again. Take draw 25 mm, take 25 mm from one side, cut an arc again from this side, cut an arc. So, next join. Okay, see, do the naming A, B, C. Clear. So, this is a top view. Okay, show one dimension. So this is 25 mm. Okay. So draw projection line upward. See, projection line should be very thin line. Okay. So draw projection line upward. So next, see if you're looking from front of an object, point A is visible, point B is visible, point C is invisible. So A dash here, B dash in the bracket, C dash. Okay. So draw straight line. Okay. So show the R mark. Projection line is going upward. Okay. So this is a surface of lamina. Okay. The lamina. This is true length triangle. True length. Okay. The lamina resting on HP with one of its corner. See corner towards your right hand side and it's towards your left hand side. Okay. So next, what the second sentence says that surface of lamina is inclined to HP at 60 degree. Inclined to HP at 60 degree. So first take 60 degree. 60 degree. Okay. So draw uh, you know very simple line. draw line where you want up to where you want then see use the surface of lamina dimension use surface of lamina dimension and this is inclined to HP at 60 degree see measure it and A should be on XY line and B should be is above XY line B dash and C dash is above XY line measure it then cut an arc okay measure it and cut an arc so this point is B dash and C dash. See, show the name angle. So this is 60 degree. So next, see the A dash and B dash is C dash is here. This is surface of lamina is inclined to HP at 60 degree. So draw the projection line downward. See where you have the point. See the point A is here. You need to draw up to here. Don't draw unnecessary line at any cost. Okay. So use thin line, 
use very thin line so this point is a so next is b and c so point is here where is b so first you will get c then you will get b okay so draw projection line from the point c okay so this point is c and this point is b clear so here projection line is going downward okay so then join a b c so join a b c second position is completed this is apparent length okay so second concept is over third one is side opposite to the corner on which lamina rest is inclined to be pc side this is a side and this one is a corner see for this corner opposite to the side is there so this side is inclined to vp at 60 degree so you need to place this side is on xy you know on inclined to vp line so take inclined to vp 30 degree take inclined to vp 30 degree okay so draw one straight line draw line see here also i am not going to use you know box method because the you know arc method is very simple for triangular lamina so instead of using box method so box method for triangular lamina is a time consumption method so better go with the arc method so you measure this dimension so this will be 2.5 mm okay select one point and cut an arc okay so measure this measure it and cut an arc so this point is c and this point is b next is measure b to a measure b to a and from the point b cut an arc similarly same distance will be there from b to c okay so b to c cut an arc sorry it c to a now join the line so this point is a join the line join the line a to b next b to c see this is inclined to vp at 60 degree so next project the projection line upward see a is on xy line draw up to x y line this point is a dash next c is above x y line and b is also see this point is c dash next and b is also above x y line so this point is b dash so show the r mark so projection line going upward okay so next join the line okay so third one is side opposite to the corner is inclined to vp so all dimensions are in mm thank you